to Vlogmas. It's weird not saying Vlogmas day, whatever. And I will say this is the least stressed I've ever been, the least technical difficulties I've ever had. It's been great. I had to go to the post office this morning and I pick up a few things I thought I would show you. At Shoppers, this was on sale. This is my current preferred protein powder. And then I got some new body wash, which I haven't had in probably a year and a half. I love this one. So I treated myself deodorant. Um, I'm not sure if I've showed this in a video yet, but I am loving these Sally Hansen vegan nail polishes. This one is pomegranate punch. So I thought this would be a festive polish to do. I haven't had my nails painted in a few months because they chip so bad. They're so dry from all the hand washing, but might paint my nails this morning and then some dry shampoo oh. and a son mm. who's probably going to try and tell me that he's wasting mm. away starving. Mm. Oh, okay, just checking in. He's making sure I wasn't getting any food. We are officially under a snowfall warning and it is actually snowing, although it has lightened already. So. My day today is quite chocker block full. You gonna try and come tell me that you're wasting away starving? Oh, you wanna come say hi? Hi, Thomas. So we're supposed to get haircuts today, both of us. We go to La Bella Vida in OK Falls. My friend Karen, who is amazing. She's great with Thomas. She's cut my hair for years now. We're not eating. No. Just sort of waiting to see what the weather does. It's only 9.30 right now and our haircuts aren't until 1.30. But I told, I like prefaced it, like prepared her yesterday and she was like, yeah, I totally understand if you can't come. So it's about a 20 minute drive in the summer. No. Ah, oh, goodbye. I don't know if you just heard that, but the unicorn just left for work and honked and Thomas just waved. <laughs> Their little bond is so sweet. <sighs> so my day today is right now waiting to see what the weather does. In an hour and a half, we have a walk planned with some friends, a socially distanced walk. My girlfriends and I go for a walk every week. And so I'm hoping they'll still want to, even though it's snowing. And I'm hoping that Thomas will still want to, even though it's snowing. <sighs> just gonna wait I'll call it in probably an hour and see but then also today is the day I got my house cleaned so we need to leave anyway so we'll be gone for a couple hours um, I will probably just order us lunch out like sushi pick it up and eat it in the car I'm not sure what today's gonna look like to be honest and then the most exciting, the grand finale this evening or late this afternoon, we are gingerbread house decorating with my niece and my sister. That's something that my niece Elizabeth and I have done for years. And my niece Quinn, I think, is gonna get in on the action this year too over Zoom, which is so fun. Like, there's a lot of garbage about 2020, but there's also a lot of wonderful things like this. So. We are going to do that. That I've been looking forward to. I think my sister and I planned this like, I don't even know, three weeks ago, a month ago. Um, I had to go to the post office this morning to pick up her, Christmas, her birthday present, so I'm happy that that arrived. But I also just feel a lot of like admiration and empathy for anyone who works in the postal service. So like, if anything's late, I'm like, I know, it's, it's fine. God, you guys have so much going on. Where are you going? You want to go ride your bike, don't you? Uh, or you want to go upstairs? Uh, okay, you can go upstairs. Or do you want to go ride your bike? Okay, he wants to go ride his bike. I'm gonna get him set up on his bike. And then I think I'm gonna start a Christmas movie and maybe wrap some presents. Uh, or just relax, I'll look at him, he's like, are, are you coming, mom? We're gonna charge your iPad, bud. So it's charged for when we're out of the house. What Christmas movie are we gonna watch, you ask? Currently watching A California Christmas. I'm not gonna judge it yet, but so far, not super Christmassy. 
way too much sadness, but obviously I'm gonna keep watching. <laughs> and I are in the car and we are gonna have a little sushi picnic lunch. Our walk was beautiful as you saw and Thomas did really well. No whining, loved it. We've got a little sushi heaven. We're gonna have a little picnic. It's our view. I'll show you our view. Snowy ambiance. On the side of Mickey. <laughs> All right, let's dig in. This looks good. you saw, I got a pre-made gingerbread house. Game changer. Thomas isn't here to make the gingerbread. He's just here to pretend to put the candy on it and not eat it, but let's be honest. The next like hour is basically just gonna be how much goes in his mouth and how much actually goes on the house. So we got little score bits, some strawberry puffs, some white Reese's peanut butter cups, perhaps a snowman-esque family, some gooey fish because Thomas loves an episode of Mickey Mouse Clubhouse where Pete and Mickey fish for gooey fish. And then these are the candies that the like gingerbread house comes with. Does anybody just use what, what comes with the house? We also got jubes as reinforcement and half a bag of black licorice because I already got into it last week. I know this is a controversial candy. I love it. And some like extra icing. So, debating putting on a onesie. Are you okay? You just fell from like four feet onto the ground. Are you okay? This camera, I know I need a new camera. But she's, she's a tough old bird. This camera's almost four years old. And I am not polite to it. No. Okay, I think, am I open up pajamas? I might open up pajamas. I just basically wanted to see if um, you broke. It, I was just thinking yesterday that this has been the calmest vlogmas and the one with the least amount of technical difficulties. Because without fail, something happens. When you're, my camera broke, Oh, it was two or three cameras ago. Usually it will get an iMovie crash or <laughs> something. <laughs> something happens. But so far, so good. It felt really nice to get outside and go for a walk. It's so mild out and Thomas did awesome. He didn't complain once, which bodes well because I'd like to do a walk every single day while he's on Christmas vacation. I think this is the first time I've complained about my sleep in Vlogmas, but I only got four hours of sleep last night, so I'm a bit tired. But the good news is I'm about to sit here and play with candy. And I just went for a nice walk and had sushi with Thomas in the car. He was definitely like, why aren't we driving? <laughs> I thought he'd like it more than he did. He liked it, and then once he was done eating, he was just like, okay, as we do, mom, which is cute. Where do we start? I know. What are you guys thinking? What do you want to start with? We thought we put it on a bigger cutting board in case we want to make extra little houses and stuff. Smart. I'm guessing roof. Do you want to start with the roof? That's, yeah, that's the roof. Good job. Yeah. 
No, oh, no, 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 no. Mm. Thank you. He's like, hey. Mm. I was watching that. Oh, yeah. Look, we're hanging out with your cousin and your aunt. Should we start with black licorice on the roof, maybe? <laughs> Me too. I could just break them. Okay, yeah, ready? Yeah. Go this way? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's going to be a little bit that you can eat every time. Lucky guy. <laughs> Here you go. Ready to yes, go? we were having the conversation about are we making it so it's a nice or organized house or just as much candy as we can fit on it. And what was your decision? As much candy as we can fit yeah, Obviously. On it. I mean, obviously. We're not here to win any awards. No. <laughs> Whoa, and then we'll take this and we stick it on. Ready? There we go. And hold it. Maybe just take one up and on and see how it goes. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Good work. Got some progress happening. I put some score bars on the back and they were real ugly. So we're doing what we can here. I got my sister and my niece on Zoom. There we go. Our face on. Yeah, exciting. They're making theirs too. Thomas is helping. He's just doing a math game at the moment. He's actually been super helpful. So I'd like to know, when you make a gingerbread house, do you go aesthetic or just cram as much candy as possible? Because we're definitely in the cram as much candy category. Oh, that would be pretty. It's looking good. It's looking good. We did our little cram cracker houses. Whoa. Right. Architecture. I know. It's impressive. It was good. Magic <laughs> yeah. putting lights on our house. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, those light bulb candies. That's fun. Here is Thomas's gingerbread house in all of her glory. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. As you can tell, I'm definitely uh, as much candy on as possible kind of gal. We've got a gooey fish pond and some snow. We've got a path. Yeah, I'm very happy with this. It was so fun. So nice to do that. We've never done that on, um, like, digitally before. Digitally? We've never done that before, like, over FaceTime, and it was so special. So nice to see them. We spent two hours. It was awesome. Now we'll just wait and see how long it is before little fingers start to eat this. Here is the salad. It's kind of like a little sushi salad because I had some leftover ginger and avocado from lunch. Tofu and like an Asian dressing with this. Um, something that I forgot to tell you is we did not finish that Christmas in California, a Californian Christmas movie. Let me know if you did. It just was like sad and not Christmassy at all. So I would not recommend that one. There's plenty of other wonderful Christmas movies and Christmas content to enjoy. Thomas is going to ride his bike and I'm going to journal. <laughs> <laughs>